Hello, how to solve for a and b in this equation a plus b is equal to 5, ab is equal to 100. Solution. a plus b is equal to 5. Let us call this equation 1. ab is equal to 100. Let us call this equation 2. Then from equation 1, a plus b equal to 5. Therefore, b is equal to 5 minus a. Let us call this equation 3. Also from equation 2, ab is equal to 100. Let us substitute for b here. This is the same thing as a bracket 5 minus a is equal to 100. Let us open the bracket. a multiplied by 5. This is 5a minus a multiplied by a. a square is equal to 100. Then this is the same thing as 5a minus a square minus 100 is equal to 0. Let us divide all through by minus 1. 5a divided by minus 1. This will be minus 5a. Minus a square divided by minus 1. This will be plus a square minus 100 divided by minus 1. This is plus 100 is equal to 0. Let us put this in standard form. Here we have a square minus 5a plus 100 is equal to 0. This is a quadratic equation which can be solved using quadratic general formula. From quadratic general formula, s is equal to minus b plus or minus square root of b square minus 4 ac over 2a. From this equation, a is equal to 1, b is equal to minus 5, c is equal to 100. But we are looking for the value of a here. So a will be equal to minus bracket minus 5 plus or minus square root of minus 5 square minus 4 multiplied by 1 multiplied by 100 everything over 2 multiplied by 1 a is equal to minus times minus 5 this is 5 plus or minus square root of minus 5 square that is 25 minus 4 multiplied by 1 multiplied by 100 that is 400 over 2 and this is the same thing as 5 plus or minus square root of 25 minus 400 that is minus 375 over 2. Now from here a is equal to 5 plus or minus. This can be written as square root of 375 multiplied by minus 1 over 2. Now let's see. 375, this is divisible by 5. 5 in 37, that is 7 remain to win 25 5 then this 75 is also divisible by 5 5 in 7 1 remain to in 25 that is 5 here is 15 15 is divisible by 5 5 in 15 3 then 3 is divisible by 3 that is 1 therefore here we have 5 times 5 and then 5 times 3, this is 15, 
and there is 25. Therefore, 375 is equal to 25 multiplied by 15. This can be written as a is equal to 5 plus or minus square root of 375 become square root of 25 multiplied by 15 then multiply by this minus 1 over 2 and a is equal to 5 plus or minus we have square root of 25 multiply by square root of 15 multiply by square root of minus 1 everything over 2 but square root of minus 1 is equal to i then square root of 25 is equal to 5 this can be written as a is equal to 5 plus or minus 5i square root of 15 over 2. 5 is common here. This can be written as 5 over 2 bracket 1 plus i root 15. plus or minus. Therefore, A1 is equal to 5 over 2 bracket 1 plus I square root of 15 and A2 is equal to 5 over 2 bracket 1 minus I square root of 15. These are the values of A. Now we've got the value of A. Let us solve for B. To solve for B, from equation 3, B is equal to 5 minus a then b1 is equal to 5 minus a1 is the same thing as 5 over 2 bracket 1 minus 1 plus i square root of 15 and b1 is equal to 10, if you expand this, minus 5 minus five i square root of 15, everything over 2. B1 is equal to 5 minus 5 i square root of 15 over 2 then b1 is equal to 5 over 2 bracket 1 minus i square root of 15 this is the value of b1 also b2 is equal to 5 minus 5 over 2 bracket 1 minus i square root of 15 b2 is equal to 5 over 2 bracket 1 plus i square root of 15 this is the value of b2 Therefore, our final answer are a1 comma b1 is equal to 
5 over 2 bracket 1 plus i square root of 15 comma 5 over 2 bracket 1 minus i square root of 15 then a2 comma b2 is equal to 5 over 2 bracket 1 minus i square root of 15 comma 5 over 2 bracket 1 plus i square root of 15. This are the final answer. You can see that from here the value of a1 here is equal to the value of b2 here and the value of b1 here is equal to the value of a2 here. We may check to confirm if this answer is right or wrong. Let's check. To check, we have the given equation a plus b is equal to 5, ab is equal to 100. Now let's consider this. a plus b is equal to 5. This is the same thing as 5 plus 5i square root of 15 over 2 plus 5 minus 5i square root of 15 over 2 must be equal to 5. This is 5 plus 5i square root of 15 plus 5 minus 5i square root of 15 all over 2 because the SM is true must be equal to 5. This cancel this. Then here we have 5 plus 5 over 2 must be equal to 5. 5 plus 5 this is the same thing as 10 over 2 must be equal to 5. 2 here 1, 2 here 5. 5 is equal to 5, which is true. Also, let's consider this. AB is equal to 100. It's the same thing as 5 plus 5i square root of 15 over 2 bracket 5 minus 5i square root of 15 over 2 must be equal to 100. 5 times 5, this is 25. Minus 5 times 5i root 15, this is 25i square root of 15. This is plus 25i square root of 15 and here will be minus if you multiply 5i square root of 15 by minus 5i square root of 15 we have 25 multiply by i square multiply by square root of 15 all square must be equal to 100 this cancel this, this cancel this. We have 25 minus 25 multiplied by i square is equal to minus 1 multiplied by 15. Then remember this is 2 multiplied by 2 over 4. Must be equal to 100. Then here is 25 minus 25 multiplied by minus 1 multiplied by 15. This is plus 375 over 4 must be equal to 100. Now this is 25 plus 375. This is 400 over 4 must be equal to 100. 4 year 1, 4 year 
100. So here we have 100 is equal to 100, which is true. I hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you for watching. Please don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Bye.